Hello everybody, this is Major 7... Evan. No, seriously, I understand the confusion, but it's actually Major 7. In this video, we celebrate 1000 subscribers! Wow. This is seriously an amazing achievement for me. I want to thank you all, and I want to thank Rumi for featuring me in his video. Subscribe to the channel, hit like, hit the bell to get notifications, and let me know in the comments if you like this format. You can also follow me on Instagram at Major7 underscore official, and on Facebook at Major7. Done with the good news, let's go with the bad ones. Yesterday I shot a whole day of footage and this morning when I started editing it I noticed that something got screwed up pretty badly. The audio of every video, apart from the first hour, was completely messed up. I've actually just finished doing what I promised a couple of videos ago and I'm I panicked for a couple of minutes and then I decided to try to fix everything with this introduction. Enough blubbering, let's go! Hello everybody, this is Major7. As I promised in my last video, today we're doing an unboxing and here is the box. As you might notice, it is from Thoman, that is a pretty huge music store in Germany. So, let's see what's inside. As usual, there's a lot of paper. Wow! Here it is. This other box here is a present for another person, so I'm gonna put it here. Let's get rid of this. Okay, this is gonna be my bait for today's practice. Let me introduce you to Thumb and Man. Yeah. Okay, don't worry, it's all right. So, what I want to do today is uh, to practice for the whole day with an instrument I've never played that you might have guessed by now what the instrument actually is. Damn it! I've killed Tom and Man. Okay, nice. So, as I was saying, what I want to do today is to practice for the whole day with an instrument I've never played. Let's see what's inside, I don't have a clue whether I'm going to find a playable instrument or not. If the strings are on the instrument or not. Okay, this is what's inside the box. There is a bow, there is the instrument, the strings are already on it. Obviously not tuned, but I should be able to start playing it immediately. So what I'm going to do now is to... What I'm going to do now is to use YouTube to find out some information about the instrument and how to get started with it. There is a duo of YouTubers that I follow, there is Two Set Violin, that is where I got most of the information about this instrument. And I found now a video by Eddie Chen, that is one of the Two Set Violin, titled What Every Beginner Violinist Needs to Know. So let's check it out. So this is the instrument, it's a Stentor Student 2 and this is the bow that comes with the violin. I've got to put the rosin on the hair of the bow in order to make it have some sort of friction on the strings and make them vibrate, thereby producing sound. What did I want myself to have all of the answers and the meanings behind everything I see? I can see no difference in this thing here and no difference here. I was enslaved. Oh, yeah. What's happening? As you might notice here, it's starting to get white and powdery. As I feel, release control. So, first part done, let's move to something else. I guess that tuning the instrument is gonna be the next step. Tutorial on how to tune the violin. <sighs> okay, what's happening here? This string should be a G, but it's actually playing a probably D. Whenever I go a little bit up, it goes back down quite a lot. It's a D now. Damn it. Just goes back. This is what happens when you buy cheap instruments, but usually not this much. Just goes back. We are almost there. Right now this is an F sharp, so if I use the fine tuner... Yeah! I've got my first properly playing string. Just one dropped. 
to a left again. Damn it. Okay, we are almost there. I'm trying to tighten them a little bit more than I should. It's new, it's normal. Every time I tune them uh, 10 seconds later, tension has already gone down. G, a little bit sharp. D, a little bit sharp. A, a little bit sharp. E, a little bit sharp. Yeah, probably doesn't sound completely in tune, but... say, I thought it would have come uh, uh, out much worse. Uh, it actually plays. And I'm also pretty impressed by the fact that it already sounds like a violin. I thought it would sound like a cat being run over by a car, but no, it sounds like a violin. It doesn't sound really good, but... This was the last point of usable footage I had. After that I kept on practicing for roughly 8 hours. I stopped when I thought that my neighbors might have wanted to sleep. Let me point out that my back and my neck are pretty sore today. A friend of mine who plays violin came up to give me some hints and I tried to learn a song that I'm going to play for you at the end of this video. Here is a short summary of the whole day with a song by Another Story that is one of my bands as the background given that the audio was unusable. Actually all the songs that I use as background music are by the same band. I'm sorry for having just killed Christmas. I hope that this instrument will become part of the instruments I can actually play. Again, thank you all for watching. Share this video if you liked it. Bye bye by Major7.